Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Dorian. Dorian, how old are you? I'm 27. Okay, and what do you do? Um, I work for a Fortune 50 um, company as an insurance agent. I also rap. Oh, mm -hmm. okay, very cool. Yeah. <laughs> uh, now, uh, I know you see rap. What else do you do for fun? Um, for fun, I like to travel a lot. I like to stamp my passport. I'm very adventurous, skydiving, jet skiing, whatever the world brings us. Nice. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> now, what is... Wow. Damn. <laughs> okay. Y'all don't like to travel? I guess not. <laughs> now, what are some things you look for in a man? What do I look for in a man? I really like an outgoing guy. I'm a very outgoing person, respectful, um, emotionally intelligent, and I also like a man that makes as much money as me or more. Mm, okay. Exactly. Nice. Get the bag. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now, what are some deal breakers? Deal breakers? <sighs> felonies, but the felonies as far as sexual, mm. violent, Small penis. <laughs> Deal breaker. <laughs> All right, so Period. we did get. I'm just being honest. We did get a couple pop balloons. That's fine. Let's go ahead and they see my wish they didn't pop, pop it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, your name and age, and why you ended up popping your balloon. Oh, uh, my name's Dante. I'm 25. <laughs> and why'd you pop Dante? Don't don't get on me internet, bro. Um, Spots on your stain in your little dress. I you know, was in the bag me? drunk, so whatever. Oh, uh, yeah. You feel me? I can't it's do fine. That. It's a $300 dress. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to. Uh, it's the $300 dress. My bad. I got a little makeup on it. Just to show it's like you can pay attention to care stuff like that. You feel mm. me? You're trying to be presentable. Just that, yeah. Okay. You feel me? That's Respect all. that. She's pretty. Pretty. Mm. Gracias. Mm -hmm. Now, is he someone that's your type? Um, No, I'm not going to. Where are you from? From Michigan. He's from Michigan, and he has a cowboy hat on. No, I can see if he was from Texas or something. I feel like Southern boys wear the cowboy hats. I'm not a big fan of the cowboy hat. Y'all are so mean. They got country boys in Michigan. <laughs> Anyways, next. Name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is Ryan. I'm 26. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Mm -hmm. And I think you just had an unwelcoming demeanor. And that was it. We know why. I mean... You know, everybody popped their balloon, so I might as well be honest. I mean, I, I don't want to get into it, but I can understand why you would think I have an unwelcoming demeanor. But you're very handsome, Ryan. I love your dimples, but I'm actually very much a sweetheart. Next. Okay. <laughs> Name and age and why you ended up popping? Chris, 27. Mm -hmm. Just because I don't do those skydiving. You know, I'm, I'm scared of heights. Mm. And so I had, I had problems in my past. With my last girl, she was tweaking with me because I didn't want to do the little... With the, uh, the Superman thing in Vegas, we didn't broke up over that. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was bad. Okay. Okay. And you said your name is? Chris. Chris. So you pop my balloon because you don't like skydiving? You said you like doing adventure stuff. Skydiving, what'd you say? Jumping out of airplanes, uh, roller coasters? I don't do that. I mean, but she asked me what I like to do. She didn't ask you what you like to do. But I mean, I understand if you don't like skydiving. We could have went on a nice dinner date. You're very handsome. I love yes, the Valabasas pants. I got a couple pair myself. Mm. I like the outfit. You know, I don't think you, I think you're going to regret popping your balloon. But I understand if you don't want to go <laughs> skydiving. Everybody need a woman to get them out their comfort zone. So now, apart from her saying, you know, the skydiving, whatever it is, is she someone that is your type? Yeah, for sure. Okay. You know, I mean, I, I like the demeanor. I ain't going to lie. Thank you. That ain't a problem with me at all. Mm -hmm. I like the demeanor. I wouldn't make you skydive. If you said no, I would take no for an answer. Okay. Yeah, but okay. you can follow my Instagram. I think I can get you to skydive. You think so? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. I feel a little vibe here. You want that balloon back? He don't got to take his balloon back. We not begging. Let's go to the next. Oh, no. We're not begging, <laughs> but he looks like he's feeling you, girl. He it's looks cool. like he's If you don't want to skydive, I understand, but you got to get out your comfort zone. You got to explore different things. You got to enjoy your life. You young, so. Hey, you ain't lying. Yeah. You're good. We gonna move on then. <laughs> All right, your name and age, and why you ended up popping your balloon. My name is John. I'm 31, mm -hmm. and I popped my balloon because you came out a little aggressive. You feel me? I like femininity. I'm not saying you're not feminine, but your demeanor maybe it's the liquor. You feel me? But no. And I think we're from the same city, and I'm mm -mm. not trying to date no women from that. So. Oh, you from Indianapolis? I'm from Indiana. Oh my so. gosh, I love that. So first of all, what side of Indianapolis are you I'm from? From the east side. What part? Uh, Arlington. You from Arlington, like yeah, 46? 46 in Arlington. All right, shout out to the east side of Indianapolis. Shout out. 
If you're from Indianapolis, you know why I'm like I am the way I am. I'm from East Side. I mean, aggressive is crazy. Femininity is crazy. I feel like my hair is done, my nails is I'm done. I'm not saying you're not feminine. I said, but you came out a little aggressive. And Did it was I cuss? Like, you was on a de defensive mode. No, I think you guys all look handsome. I just, I'm just very like, this is my personality. I don't feel like I got to tone down for nobody. But I respect that you want somebody that maybe you can run over. Not like that, but. But you're very handsome. I love the slugs. I'm from Indianapolis. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet I'm you. I'm from too. the east side of Indianapolis. Actually, I'm from. Well, maybe like, we need to link on some friendship shit, though. Friendship? Yeah. I don't think I want to be your friend. You embarrassed me on public YouTube <laughs> with 1.5 million people. But I think that if you go home and then you mention my name, I think that you'll be presently surprised. Like, I can't talk, but anyways, you'll be <laughs> pleasantly surprised. I think you'll actually hit me up after that. I well, you're very it. handsome. I love a chocolate man. Love your dreads. You look good. I like the Jordans. 10 out of 10. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go to our next guy. Your name and age and why you ended up popping. Uh, I'm Trey, 25, and I believe our, our temperaments would clash. Uh, the personalities that we have. Uh, I'm not a big fan of, of drunkenness in public. <laughs> or okay. Just the idea of, it's just how it comes across. It's not, I'm not. Mm hmm tagging you with that i'm just saying that's how it came across at first mm -hmm. uh but that's really it i believe i believe you're actually beautiful thank you, you kind of favorite glorilla that to me that's why glorilla is crazy i think glorilla is beautiful <laughs> i'm dark skin i think more like kelly Rowland, but i appreciate the compliment that's that's fine as well gracias but but that's really it i just believe our temperaments will clash that's okay all. okay, okay. No, is he someone that's your type no he's not my type okay why you not know, I, I just don't think I would like to be out on a nice dinner date or skydiving with somebody that ha wears pearls. I'm not drunk at all. A little tipsy, you know, they gave us some drinks in the back, but I feel like I'm really put together. I feel like I'm carrying, carrying myself classy. Absolutely. But if that's how you feel, then that's how you feel. I don't like the pants. I'm going to be honest. I think that since you're light-skinned, you should have worn something a little bit more, <laughs> less olive. But okay. But you're handsome, though. Thank you. Love your beard. I love the earrings. She I think the gold looks... Hold on. She <laughs> called it a beard, y'all. Yeah, I think, I think, for a minute. I think, it's a beard I, now, you feel me? <laughs> I think that, honestly, opposites attract. So I feel like if you feel like our temperaments would clash, yeah. I feel like you should get a little bit more confidence. I don't know. I That's think what you, you be doing with some I, match. I think that you should maybe date somebody that is more out there and get you out your comfort zone. I appreciate the input. Yeah, Thank you. You're welcome, handsome. Okay. Let's yeah. go over here. Mm -hmm. Your name and age, and why did you end up popping your balloon? I'm so sad. How you doing? My name is Nati. I'm 25 years old. Mm -hmm. uh, I popped my balloon. I just didn't like the going back and forth with people. It's just not for me, that's all. Okay. But you're very pretty. You know. Gracias for the compliment. Thank you. I'm not going to say it's going back and forth. Going back and forth sounds more like an argument. I feel like you guys stated your opinions about me and how you felt, and I feel like I gave you my opinions about y'all. I don't think it's a go going back and forth. I think that we're all adults, and we should expect, um, respect each other's opinions. So, I mean, if that's how you feel, that, that's a red flag to me, because imagine if we didn't agree on something, and I said what I said, and you said what you said, now you feel like I'm going back and forth like a kid. No, it's just, we just disagree. But I respect that. I think you're very handsome. Your hair is curly. You look Thank good. You. Thank you. I like the shirt. Where you get it from? <laughs> My mama. Your mama. mom. <laughs> Bless your mom. She's a great mom. It, it's nice. It's well tailored. No, it's real tailored. I like the gold. I like that. You, you look good. Appreciate it. You're welcome. Let's go to our next guy. Mm -hmm. Your name and age, and why you ended up popping your balloon? I really want to know. Uh, yeah, my name is Key. I'm 28. Mm -hmm. uh, really, uh, to be honest, man, the physical attraction just isn't there. But I was going to give you a chance. I was going to hear you out. You know, it's not, I mean, you don't look bad at all. Mm -hmm. But I mean, you, you know, you look pretty good. But then you said you rap. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I'm not really cool with that. And then all the traveling and stuff. So, like, the rapping, the traveling, the mm -hmm. being out, it's just, I don't like a busy woman like that. That's too doing a little bit too much yeah okay and that's understandable like pretty much it went back and forth almost every dude up here no. so i feel like it kind of a little argumentative a little bit so like i can see us being out on a date and you going back and forth with a waiter because something ain't cooked right or, like, wow so you think i d uh, disrespects uh civilians and people that serve other people and do their job these do civilians they're civilians but they all gave their opinion on me and what they didn't like about me and i gave my opinion about back well, i'm just saying it was real like it was it was pretty strong like it wasn't it's really I'm not saying you don't have a class, but I'm just saying it wasn't like classy, like how you okay. conduct yourself. I'll wait till he's done. It's but, my turn. Yeah, I'm, I'm done. Yeah, you go ahead. Okay, physical See attraction. So, what's the physical attraction? I would love for you to get in detail. I mean, it's just not like if, if I seen you out in the grocery store in the mall or something, I just like, I mean, you don't, like I said, you don't look bad. I just wouldn't really approach you like that. What's your type? 
my type. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I would love what you are physically attracted to since you're not physically attracted yeah. to me, which I'm not really. I mean, I like I like natural hair. Uh huh. Um, like, so I'm gonna keep it real. It's not so much like. Be honest. You can be pretty, but like the way you carry yourself can make you. I ain't gonna say ugly, but it can. All that go out the window. So you felt like I carried myself a, okay, aggressively. A little bit. I, like I said, I don't know if it was the the drinks, but it was. No, this is it, how okay, I am all it, the time. It wasn't pleasant. I say that. It wasn't pleasant. Yeah. Do y'all all feel that way? Yeah, I don't see no. Blowing. I feel like y'all. I feel like y'all intimidated. I feel like I'm a very pleasant person. I feel like I understand the physical attraction. Me too. I pay attention to detail. I feel like you're dark skin. Your hair is pretty. You got a nice look to your, you know, face, whatever. Yeah, appreciate it. Appreciate Me personally, I wouldn't put on no Dolce Cabanas because I feel like they played out because I'm into swag or whatever the case may be. That's all good. I feel like my attitude is actually very great. I feel like any man that dates me is going to be overwhelmed with me just supporting his confidence and me building him up. I feel like that if you guys don't like a woman that likes to have a conversation or maybe disagree every once in a while, then y'all should reevaluate re yourself. Um, also, as far as you saying that I'm the type of person that you feel like if we were outside and a waitress or a waiter um, said that I got into it with them or whatever you said, I'm sorry, I was kind of listening. Um, I think that is very... Um, I don't know word. I don't know how to describe it, but I mean, I go on five star dinner restaurants all the time. People make mistakes. I'm not going to fault anybody or be disrespectful because they make mistakes. But if somebody says something to me, I am going to speak my mind and then I'm going to give my man a chance to give me their opinion and I'm going to go back. Let's head on back. Thank you. All right. Well, that is all the balloons popped, mm -hmm. but we do thank you for coming on. Thank Let's you. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I'll take this mic. Oh.